What makes Erasmus Mundus scholarship stand out? What makes it more, what makes it unique out of all the other scholarships? welcome back to my channel thank you for joining me today you know i can see that the channel is growing little by little so thank you for joining me today so guys today i want to tell you why you should apply for the erasmus mundus scholarship and i'm not even joking today like why do you need to apply to the erasmus mundus scholarship so hmm okay guys like every other scholarship we have you know the other scholarships we have you know erasmus mundus covers your tuition fees, your travel costs, your monthly stipends, your installation fees, and you know, the regular things scholarship um, offers. But beyond that, hmm, what makes Erasmus Mundus scholarship stand out? What makes it more, what makes it unique out of all the other scholarships? And guys, this is what I found about the Erasmus Mundus scholarship. Like, it's not something you can readily find in other scholarships. There is no single scholarship that has this list of things I'm about to tell you that the Erasmus Mundus scholarship has. I have checked and checked and checked, but then if you get to find any other one that has it, please let me know in the comment section. Please let me know in the comment section. But from my research, I have got, I've searched and searched and I was unable to find anyone. So now here are the reasons why you need to apply for the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship. Here are the reasons that make the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship stand out out of all the other scholarships I've seen and I've come across. Now, number one, the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship gives you an opportunity to study in at least two European universities in two European countries. Can you beat that? At least, though, they did not say maximum, like at least. Now, some people get to study in like five, six universities in Europe, like in different countries. Some people get to study in like six different countries. Some people. Now, aside that, sometimes the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship takes you out to the Americas and, you know, like... I know some programs that take you to the US, some programs take you to the um some programs take you to Canada. I know others too that take you to Australia. I know one, I know a couple too that takes you to Asia. I know another one also that you have to do one of your mobility in South Africa, another one in um, I think Namibia, yes. So you get to travel around. These options are attached to your program. You get to travel in at least two universities two universities in two different european countries at least though like for me i'm going to two, three different universities in three different countries in europe that's for the universities though and then i have an option of joining two organizations also in other countries like it's so amazing that's like i'm traveling like two extra countries going to be with two extra organizations like it's so amazing like these are this one gone gone like you rarely find this in any scholarship like you rarely find it in any scholarship the second thing is it gives you an opportunity to learn multiple languages and cultures so you're going to be traveling like six countries of course you're going to be learning the way of life of these people you're going to be learning their languages and all that now aside that i like aside the fact that you're going to try to learn these cultures and languages on your own with your peers you are also going to be taught like erasmus Mundus scholarship programs offer language courses to you to help you you know immerse yourself in the day-to-day -day activities of the countries you are in or the countries you'll be going to like they help you they provide language classes for my program we're provided with about six different language um, courses. And we had to choose. There was Mandarin, there was um, a German language, there was um, Portuguese, there was French, and I think there was Russian. And I chose French actually, because I've been learning French, I needed to improve in my French language. And this has been really helpful. Also in learning the cultures, 
Erasmus Mundus Scholarship offers you an opportunity, like a learn course, like where they are going to guide you through learning a um, way of life of other people. For my program, it's called Intercultural Competency Training. Ah, can you beat that? Like in the course, like you get to, they get to take you through the process of learning other people's culture, how to relate with other people and all that. And it has been really, really helpful. Like this program, you get to discuss with your colleagues, like how are things done in your country, how how things done in this side, how things, like you, get, you guys get to share experiences and all that. Like, hmm, this is one of the things I love most about the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship, this intercultural competency training. The training is not like to make you a professional in uh, cultures and all, no, it's just to, you know, give you a soft landing, you know, give you the basis on, you know, how to relate and, you know, find your way around Europe. Yes, yeah, so that is it. Another thing that the Erasmus Mundus Scholarship offers you that. You can barely find in other uni uh, other scholarships is the summer school option. Ha! Summer school option, like oh my god! Like for my program, it's offering us um four locations, four destinations for our summer school. One in Ireland, one in Germany, and you know other countries. As for me, hmm. I'm going to the one in Germany. <laughs> the one in Germany, actually, like I'm going to the one in Germany. Ha! Because Germany is not. Ordinarily, among those of our regular countries, then that are attached straight attached to the semester um, countries. So I chose Germany. Like, hey, I have to go to Germany for my summer school. So that's it, guys. Another thing hmm, that the scholarship offers you is a skill-based internship or traineeship. So Erasmus Mundus Scholarships comes with it comes with internships or traineeships. For students, like it's attached to your program. Now, but sometimes some programs decide to make it optional. Maybe some other students want to use their summer period or their internship period for other things. So they give you that leverage. Some programs give you that leverage to choose. Like for my program, it's like if you want to, if you don't want to, and stuff like that. Or for me, hmm, this gear, hey, this gear. Ah, I am going to the internship. I am going for that internship. So, yes, there are some this scholarship comes with skill-based internship or traineeship. Eh, hey, oh shit. <laughs> okay, guys, another thing. Another thing. This is ha, ah, this is the last thing I'll be saying today. So that I will not bust people's heads too much. I will not bust people's heads too much. Another thing that the Erasmus Mundus scholarship comes with is the collaborative research placement. What did I say? I said collaborative research placement. So guys, you know, some students would want to take the more professional um, routes in their research process and in, their, in, their, in conducting their research. Some students would want to do the regular conventional research style, which is you are in a university and you have a, um, a professor supervising your work and all that. That's the conventional, you know, style. Now, why those students who want to be, you know, more professional and all that, they would want to conduct their research in collaboration with an institution or an organization that is conducting a similar research, a research related to their interest area. So now, what does the Erasmus Scholarship do? Now your program gets to find you a place. How do I look, guys? <laughs> so your program gets to find you a place. Like you get to work with them hand in hand with your program to find you a place where you can research with your organization. So my program, they do it and they offer you this um, opportunity. If you have an organization already in mind, you guys work together to create that um, relationship with your organization. They would offer you a place and you would work with them. There are multiple choices on a normal, like there are organizations that come to these programs. It's Erasmus program that come to these programs and tell them that they need some of their students to work with them. And, you know, you get to put in your applications and they choose you and they pick you. Like, they help you with all that. Hey, what I go? One <laughs> So, these are the things that comes with Erasmus. Like, if you don't want to do the conventional research, like, you know, working with in the university, still doing this thing here, you know, there and there, doing your research, you can work with an organization. The organization work with them on their research, and at the end of the day, you produce a thesis um, stating all the your responsibilities, how you contributed to the research, the result of the research, you know, everything general and all that. So, guys, hmm. These are things 
all these ingredients. These are the ingredients of the Erasmus Mundus scholarship. Why ask yourself, why is it that people that get other scholarships? Hmm? Ask yourself, people that get other scholarships together with the Erasmus Mundus scholarship. We drop those other scholarships for Erasmus. Ask yourself now. Let me ask yourself, why is it so? Have you seen anybody, like you can barely find anybody that dropped Erasmus for other scholarships? Like, are they not possible? Like, it's not possible. You know, if it happen, they know they, you know they happen anywhere. So, guys, like, these are the reasons why you, the Erasmus Mundus scholarship is outstanding. Like, you can barely find this, this ingredients, you know, the pepper, salt, maggi, onion, thyme, and curry. You can barely find it in any other scholarship. Like, it's rare. It's rare. Like, if you have any other scholarship that comes with these things, complete, intact, please let me know. Please let me know. Put it in the description. No, not description. Put it in the comment section below. Let me know. Let me know that scholarship. Because I've searched. I have searched around, I did not find anyone, so just let me know guys, and so these are the reasons, if you are yet to apply to the Erasmus Mundu Scholarship, my dear, you are missing, no, oh, you are missing, no, oh, better go and apply for the Erasmus Mundu Scholarship, like, <clears throat> for those of you who just graduated and all that, please, Erasmus Mundu Scholarship should be your number one, because it is the champion, do you get it? You get it now. Okay. So, guys, please go ahead and apply to the Erasmus Mundu Scholarship. Don't forget, you can apply to at most three different programs. So, you can apply for to three different programs. Don't apply more than three. Oh. Apply for three different programs. Okay, if you apply more than three, you get the scholarship, they'll take it away. Mm -hmm.